know. I did it for you. <laughs> she says, go to Santa Claus. You can see her there. She's going to be there, I think, training and stuff. People who are, who are what? so boring. Everyone keeps going on about this Santa Claus. What is it? It's a town. Right. It's to the west. So would it, it, okay. did it used to be Santa Cruz or something or not? Uh, I don't know where Santa Cruz is in comparison to where we are. No, uh, she she uh, makes her no uh, geography role to know about places and shit. She goes, no, it used to be a, some city called San something. Hmm. Yes. San Andres. I, I don't see the fault with that, she says. Uh-huh. <laughs> eat, eat the, yeah, so what, you used to work, work the circuit at Las Vegas or something? I mean, no, I don't know. Really <laughs> go away, she says. Go away. Would it, perhaps, once we're dealt with this, would you like to go out for a meal somewhere <laughs> in public and where where we could discuss things? Hmm. Yes, yes. I, I, all right. I think he's asking you for a date. I see. Give me a seduction roll, McKay, as she looks you up and down and thinks of it over. I've got no idea what this woman looks like either. <laughs> she's, she's not really, she's pretty average, actually. Uh, not really, like, good or yeah, bad. Makes, I make seduction roll. Yeah, all right, she says. <laughs> as in, how old does she look? Uh, she looks like a mid thirties. Okay. Uh, a little old. Yeah. Uh, well, it depends on now. <laughs> I mean, you, you, my character is like hundreds 20s. of years. Yeah, but you you could be actually hundreds of years old. You just yes, yes, don't yes. know. Yeah, I know. She could be as well. Mid thirties, brown hair, average appearance, uh, 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 with a scar on her right hand. Mm. Hmm. Uh, oh, give me uh, give me a spot hidden negative thirty if you make it an evidence analysis roll of negative thirty to pull a Sherlock fucking Holmes. What? Just uh, Pete? Anybody can. Yeah, not, be, not you can out Sherlock anything. Holmes, Sherlock Holmes, if you wanted to. Mm. No. Is it Mr. Darby? Yeah. Yep. Not Good. a negative 30, unfortunately. She keeps her secrets. Except she is a horrible at lying. I don't suppose she has uh, sunglasses on, does she? Yeah, yes, I that's what I was curious about. No, no, you can see her eyes. Okay. Right. Okay. So how far is this Santa Claus? Can we... Uh, is it like what a day's ride? What? Uh, she says. Ah, so you're going to Santa Claus Town? Uh, let's see. Well, that's where you said Lacey was going. So. Uh, yes. Um, in order to get to Santa Claus, um, well, are you taking the train, which is really expensive, or are you going to be uh, walking, which is really cheap and take a long time? It'll be days if you Possibly walk. Well. The problem is, depending on how far it is by horseback and whether or not Lacey went riding somewhere and then got a train. Uh, she may have been, to yeah, she may not have uh, made it. I do not know. She yeah, says, well. And uh, you may need to go after her to make sure she's safe and hasn't encountered okay. trouble on the road. Here's how you get to Santa Claus. Follow the coast road out east. Uh, it's about a day and a half. Uh, no, it's about a day until you get to a uh, small village. Uh, it's called the Boo. B U. Yeah. Then go four days uh, through the mountains until you get to uh, uh, Ventura Village. You say east or west? Because initially you said west. West. Mm. You just said east. I didn't, she says. You did. Well, you said follow the coast road out east. Oh, sorry, west. Uh, then uh, once you get to Ventura Village, 
uh, follow the road for three more days and you'll be in Santa Claus. There you go. Does the train stop at each of the locations? Yes. Uh, by train, let's see, how many days was that total that I told you? That many hours uh, by train. Eight. 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 So a long house ride by train. It, they stop every village, so probably be about 10 hours by train. So, so she went by horseback, right? So I she's pro don't know. probably she not even, she's probably not even there yet. So you you hadn't organized for her to have a horse waiting outside? No, I didn't know she'd be taking off now. She's gone. Oh. As in she took off last night yesterday. Wow. Last she night. really jumped the gun. All right. Well, yes. Yes, I have been giving her sword fighting lessons and such, but Okay. What about Bo? Um, not so much. It's really hard to practice indoors. I have a lot of yes. nice things I don't want shot up. Uh, so does she? Cause does she use a a gun, a Chris gun? No, no. Okay. She has absolutely no magical talent at all. Uh, this was a huge, huge disappointment to her family, who treated her very badly. I took pity on her, trained her in yeah, what they, I could with yeah. the sword. So yes, yes, we we saw how badly they treated her. Did she have mm. disgusting? Did she have any other friends or acquaintances in town that you'd know of who could have helped her? Because someone basically got her this horse. I'm not yeah, sure of her other friends. I was pretty much like a, closer than an acquaintance and such. I how, just how trained she, her bird fighting. How did she get to know to come to you, or how did you meet her? Did someone oh, refer? I met her at the you? Gnome G Depot. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's something you might want to keep an eye out. She then does the look around. She leans forward mm. and says, I've heard from other some other people I trust. Now, I'm not going to tell you their names. Yeah, that's okay. Garden gnomes may be alive and hostile. Keep your guard up. Well, we Damn. have encountered leprechauns, so it wouldn't surprise me. Oh, well. Then you're fine. Fucking leprechauns. Mm -hmm. She looks a bit baffled at this. Like, are you shitting me? <laughs> Quick AFK, yeah, the, why don't you discuss your plans? The town of um, Victorville. Ah, um, she says. Le leprechauns are there. Out on Route 66. While you guys are standing there talking to this lady, some dude comes up and he's like, I need uh, seven cords of wood and I'll give you a pair of shoes. Shut up. <laughs> he goes off. Yeah, is smiling just because she knows we're hearing the... <laughs> and she likes that. So painful. I'm doing it on purpose. I know. At least your microphone works, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm glad. We are. So after uh, Alex gets done chasing off, some guy wanted him to chop seven cords of wood for a pair of shoes. You're getting, you're starting to find more weird shit like that going on. You're not sure what's up. Mm. So, um, is there anything else you wanted to ask this lady? She looks like she uh, would rather be doing something else. And uh, Joshua, your base empathy tells you that now is the time to go away so you don't blow your chances of a date. Let's go. Apparently, your wingman is the craziest person you've ever known. This is your wing person there, Joshua. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. Let me know the, the day before and I'll get uh, stuff ready, she says. Certainly. And what kind of place we'll be going to so I know oh, how yeah. to dress. Yeah, yeah of course. Uh -huh. Good. She appears pleased and goes back into her house. Well, yeah, right. <laughs> he goes, uh, 
I'm done. All right. I was going to say is that she could select the location as opposed to me. That way, if she's uh, feeling uncomfortable, she can set the scene. Yeah. Apparently, it's uh, you know, up to you. So. Yep. Uh, yeah. You're standing there thinking that uh, sailing right. to San Francisco could be done in three or four days. And then you can finally take on and possibly defeat a one man Again. who rules a monster infested city. Yes. <laughs> I've only killed him twice already. Exactly. They do say three times a charm. Mm, that's what they say. <laughs> mm. All right. Um, so what I was thinking is we get the train, we get, we go get off Boo, see whether or not she's passed through it yet or not. If she hasn't, then we stay at Boo and we head back and, and et cetera. We keep doing that as in, mm -hmm. if she hasn't gotten to Boo, then we get to catch it to Ventura, get it to Ventura village again, see if she's passed through. If not, <clears> then we move from Ventura village back to Boo and hopefully meet her on the road. Mm. Sounds clever. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. All right. Cool. Let's see here. Uh, hmm. Mm hmm. Well, now I'm looking for transport cost. No, you don't want to buy a handsome cab, but you do need to buy a stagecoach. Um, Essentially, it's like a... Uh, um, Ten silver an hour for your own butler. There you go. Five silver an hour for comfortable. Three silver an hour on a train for just crowded seats. Excellent. Uh, 40 kilometers an hour, bad. Day one day's worth of traveling, walking in an hour. Yep. Would you Would you like to get the uh, train with your own butler so you have somebody else to serve these two drinks? Because otherwise, I'll just sit there doing this to you until you get my drink. <laughs> yes. <laughs> right. So thirty silvers later uh, uh, for the the ride to uh, the first uh, city. Yep. Jibu. We yep. will check to see if you've gotten there yet. No problem. You guys head over to Boo. It is it is pretty much a whistle stop. Uh, that's only like a day away. Um, yeah, after after checking around there, uh, which actually you can, it's really hard. You know what she looks like, but you don't have a picture to show other people. You're like, did some strange woman on horseback show up with a sword and leather armor? And they go. We have a lot of strange people riding through here. Any in women? Last day. We have a lot of women. In, this is an equal opportunity thing. We're in not in the last day. In the last day. Uh, yes. Yes, she went through town. She uh, um, pretty much just kept going. No idea where she is. How, how long ago was it? <sighs> probably. Four hours ago? Yeah. Half a day ago? Yeah. Uh, no, it was probably a couple hours ago. Hmm. So it's probably fast. Uh, she bought she a new swap? horse here for some. Thank yeah, you. she swapped horses. Yeah, she swapped horses. Right. That's what I was wondering about. So, all right. So she's got a fresh horse. Mm -hmm. So, what do you reckon? Do we get we travel to Ventura and work our way and meet her on the way back, or head out from here and try and catch her, knowing that I don't think. Well, if you get the train, it's 120 silvers because it would be a four-hour ride to uh, Ventura Village. Yeah. Yep. With butlers. Really yes. fucking nice train car. Such good alcohol. Just pouring it down your funnel. Let's go, um, my train. <laughs> what do you reckon, Alex? Uh, yeah. We could do... Um... Go by train if you want. Try it. I don't know how expensive it is. It's oh no, no, I'm not. It's not cost. I'm just thinking time wise. In that she's she's got a four hour yeah. head start from here. Yeah. Whereas it's four days to Ventura Village. Mm -hmm. So if we go to, and she's on horse. So if we get to Ventura Village, then we're going to probably have to travel two days 
back. Yeah, with, with, your, with your knowledge of horses and stuff, if uh, each of you was to get two good horses here, buy two good horses here, and ride like the wind, you probably catch her up. Assuming the other two can ride. I know that Kinley knows how to ride, but just looking at your companions, you're thinking one of them may not have seen a horse before, and the other one may not have like ridden on top of a horse as opposed to been taken in like a handsome cab by a horse. Just so you know. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. A uh, blur. <laughs> so what do you reckon then? Venture a village and work our way back then? As opposed to try and gain on her? <clears throat> I can't ride. So Depends you can, can ride. For riding. Can't. You cannot. Yeah, no, yeah. I... I have experienced riding but um yeah i wouldn't be able to get myself out of a tricky situation or anything like that so yeah, you'd have to call myself your ass after. how about like a, could we uh, could we hire a coach or something you could then the npcs will be making the rolls is that what you want is that what you want with the train they just start and stop and slow down and speed up there i'm not even rolling for the train look at me not rolling for the train but for our coach guy yeah you're gonna end up fucking flying through the air going ah, mistakes were made mm -hmm. <laughs> look on the other's face like yeah we're fine yeah. i mean now pete might be able to drive a, a handsome cab so if you wanted to buy a handsome cab which would cost a bit more than even the train. Yeah, I'm slightly better skilled at, at driving a buggy coach, handsome cab type thing than I am at riding. And it would be the PC's first handsome cab. So you buy a handsome cab and a horse or two horses if you wanted to uh, try to get extra power. And away you go. You, you've got skill in that as well, haven't you, Alex? A uh, very, very small amount. Okay. So what are you guys going to yeah, do? It's here. Um, head head well, forward we think... and wait for her for a few relaxing days in the village? Well, or the problem, problem with that is we don't know how cattle. well she's going to go making it there. Correct. That's why I'm thinking we might need to go after her from here. All right, mm -hmm. let's go after her from here, Get a, see if we can get a buggy or a handsome cab or something. Okay. okay. But what about the alcohol? Alcohol. Uh, so let's see. Uh, you happen to buy a handsome cat, or, or of course, if you guys have skill in bicycles and shit. No. Yeah. Okay. So uh, let's see, uh, one or two hundred silvers for the horse. Where's the handsome cab price? The handsome cab is the expensive part. Don't want to buy a camel. Be something like five hundred for the handsome cab, I think. That's not buying a new one. Yeah. So six or seven hundred, depending if you want one or two horses. I recommend uh two horses, uh have one behind uh so yep. that you can switch out. Yep, two horses. Great, seven hundred silver, uh, ten gold, and you are ready to fucking give me that coach skill. Uh, you two don't have to do shit. You're just sitting inside drinking <laughs> because this is this is fucking Joshua McKay's life is enabling the drug addicts. That's pretty much what he lives for i'll take the drug addicts with me yes i'll carry them in a wheelbarrow i'll carry them up and down stairs i'll drive them in a coach etc yeah he's Log our personal assistant logan check your um messenger facebook messenger mm -hmm. Fucking oh are you sure dude we've got a lot of food in the fridge no no i'm gonna take some for tomorrow for lunch oh good uh how about my usual uh except uh um 
uh, the calzone, it can mm -hmm. be a smaller one though, because I've got a lot of extra food here. Mm -hmm. a smaller one. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, pepperoni, pepperoni, onion, mm -hmm. onion. Mm -hmm. Okay. I will put my own cheese on it. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you want to do the jalapeno poppers, those are nice. If they're pricey, no. Mm -hmm. Up to you. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's Thank you, Matthew. Mm -hmm. So it all comes down to Joshua. I'm, I'm not even asking for multiple rolls. I'm just going for the one roll and animal handling from somebody. It could be from Alex Kinley. could be from Joshua McKay. This is like switching out the horses correctly and stuff like that because it's not just enough to steer the thing. You have to be able to deal with the beast. Yep, so I make my buggy roll. Oh, well done. And the animal handling roll, it could be from Alex. He is good at that too, I believe. Animal handling horse. Yeah, well, I certainly don't have... Oh, I'm, yeah. So you're used to the serpent. I've, I've done it once. Horse. I've I done animal handling once. I'm used to the servants dealing with that. It shows, it shows him like, all right, it's hooked up. Whoosh, the horse takes off. You guys are just sitting there. Dab. <laughs> that's that's what a good old fashioned fumble gives you there. Mm -hmm. Actually, a fumble the horse will tear apart the carriage. Fail, it will run. But the horse goes galloping off and pulls you off, and you get dragged along the ground, holding the reins. I like that. I like that. There you go, mine. Excellent. Fortunately, Lovely. Alex uh, Alex is what worked beneath stairs. He knows how this is done. <laughs> yes. A man's man. Hmm. He is all that is masculine. Right. So, uh, fucking cat. Excuse me. <sighs> yes, yes, that's right. See you to my pussy. There you go, cat. Discover the doors open and flee out of it. Letting the cat out here is a fucking two-stage process. So, you guys kick ass down there, and eventually... Let's see. Um, I will roll a d3. I don't want to just pick on Yana. Although it's goddamn tempting. So, one or two equals Yana, three or four equals Matt, five or six equals Pete. This is for who's doing the luck roll. It's Pete, you lucky girl, Yana. Yes. So, Pete, give me a luck roll. Lower is better for circumstances when you find her. Uh, exact. Exact. No problem. Uh, you come upon her. She's currently fleeing eight individuals who are on horseback. Hmm. Uh, they, you can tell that they have the crisp pistols that are going really loud because you can hear the uh, eight of them over the horse riding and stuff. Uh, she is not attempting to use her bow while facing backward on the saddles. Apparently, she is not a Mongol warrior. Although, if she was, then that would be a much easier yes. time of it. The best thing is that you guys are catching up. You are behind the eight guys in your carriage going, yeah, yeah. And so you're slowly gaining ground on them. And then there's the eight of them. And then there's her up front. You think it's her. If it's not, then it's some other random person being chased by eight guys. Mm -hmm. Do either of you have a reroll? Did we want to reroll the luck to get yeah. it to be a bit better? Oh, well, what? You are catching up to them. You may even get there before they get to her. And this is eight possible attempts upcoming for Yana to be able to skin somebody. <laughs> you have to look at the big picture, Pete. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, did you have a re-roll, Yana? No, I, no. I don't have it. Yeah. Matt? No, sorry. No, that's right. Is, is it worth blowing a hero point on this to reduce the number from eight? Maybe. Uh, the the eight, eight number won't be reduced. The circumstances might be. Fuck off, cat, you horrible hunt. All right. There it goes. Is it <laughs> worth spending a hero point to reduce the circumstances? Hmm. Uh, 
True. Because the problem is going to be that you guys, I'm pretty much going to have to be controlling the wagon while you guys do the shooting or whatever. Yeah. Um, yeah I'm In the current situation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've got nothing to like, help. No, that's right. I'm just. Is it is it worth flying a hero point on? Do you think? Yeah, this is a piece of uh, trivia that somebody else knew about and didn't tell you guys about. So good deal. That's why there's eight of them exactly. Mm. Well, unless you think you can get a, a really good roll on the next one. Oh, who yeah. knows? <laughs> yeah. It's it's a one out of three well, shot. Well, I mean, it, is your luck worth trying to? Is your luck high I enough where it's worth to trying to get? Might need to roll like forties or less, I think. Under, un, he's got fifty-fifty shot, but there's only a twenty percent chance of that. Oh, well, we can get going with with the setup and see how um, we go. No problem. You guys are slowly gaining on them. You two are sitting in a rather. It's not a very spacious thing. You're kind of close together and stuff, but. Uh, the view doesn't change. It's the butt of the horse. Um, and then Pete is standing up behind you, and there's like a wood uh, roof between you guys, so you can't actually see him and be inconvenienced by him. If you need a picture of the handsome cab, I will put one up. No, I think we're good. All right. No problem. Uh, he's gaining on them. Uh, one of the guys is looking back. And he yells something. The others, you can still hear their Chris guns going really loud and such. And check. Yeah, they he they yell. All all of the eight are slowing down and like reorienting on you guys. They are uh, maneuvering their horses around. They have decided you guys look like a much better target than the lone horseman because you have a fancy fucking carriage. You must be good. Yes. <laughs> Little do they know. <laughs> and, and good news for Yana, you haven't had any laudanum in a while, so you're still able to fucking walk and shit. Right, I'm going into combat rounds. You guys have about three rounds to just do shit because they'll take them that long to sort out their horses and all their legs and, like, try to get you guys to stop or pull over or yield or something. So here we go. Three rounds. This is standard combat. Heroes are first. Nobody is knocked down, but if you were, you're instantly up. Taking a round out to role play your insanity is approved. Yana, you're first. What do you do? Uh, I take out my amazing gun. Ah, okay. You're not role playing your insanity then. No. Okay, you draw your gun. Matt, what do you do? Demons! Demons! <laughs> <laughs> take a card, Pete. You're the um, one making the coach go. It's up to you what you want to do with that. I'm making the coach keep going. Well, you, you don't actually need to do anything except, like, let the horse keep running if you want yeah, to yeah, do that. Yeah. Okay. No problem. Uh, the yeah, bad guys um, are sorting their shit out round one of three. Yes, I'm focusing on them. Keep going. No problem. Next round. Heroes are first. Defense is approved, but they're not attacking. So, uh, <laughs> Yana, you're probably you're a bit out of range for the gun, but uh, it is going to change very soon as they're all wheeling their horses around. Peter, you're just continuing down the road? This is not a good off-road vehicle, just FYI. No, that's why I'm continuing down the road. At a gallop, got it. Um, no problem. It looks like it's confusing them a bit because they're used to having to chase you, but when they're in front of you, this just fucks it all up for Yeah, everybody. I'm basically going straight through the middle of them. Good, right. good, good. No problem. And, oh, no. And let's see. Uh, <laughs> Matt, what are you doing? I lean out the, uh, the, the side of the cab. And I mm -hmm. quick draw my two handed. Okay, swords out. There's no targets within range, but oh. it, it looks like it's some kind of thing where people are wondering where was he keeping that? It get worse. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing now, Matt? It, you're you're in a horrible position for fighting because your chances of hitting Yana, the coach, or the horse are increased over anything else. Although, if you wanted to go out onto the horse with some sort of 
stupidly dangerous uh, maneuver roll or something like that, you could literally mount the back of the galloping horse. If you wanted to make it more difficult, you'd be standing on the back of the galloping horse, possibly next round ready to leap onto somebody else who's really not deserving of that kind of treatment. Sure, that sounds good. Uh, okay. You've got maneuver roll. By negative... 30, and then you'll 30. be on the horse. Yeah. You made it by 30. Mm. Great. You are freakishly good at maneuvering. You're uh, you're not quite standing on the horse, but you're definitely kind of squatting on it. <laughs> uh, Pete, it appears that he may be getting ready to decapitate the horse. You're not sure. <laughs> it's a tactical plan. <laughs> Just continuing yes. on? Yes, I'm continuing on. I asked to sort of thought I'm actually on a seat. I'm not standing. Ah, okay. I was curious about that. Uh, right. Heroes are first. Yana discharging a firearm into the air, hitting nothing. Ooh. Is approved. AKA no. ce celebra ce celebratory fire. Going, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's approved. So, uh, right. Yana, this round they come into range. Mm. Uh, one nice. guy's definitely within range, and on Matt's side, which could be any side actually, actually there's one guy who's like, stop! And now keep in mind, Matt, he is the most dangerous target. There's a guy on the side that you could try to leap on, but you're thinking if you go straight ahead, if Pete doesn't fucking dodge around it, then it's going to be you, Carriage, and Yana, and this guy and his horse all in a tight ball painful ball of pain right but the guy on the side will get you out of the way yana meanwhile wings uh her guy who goes ah yana did did you uh do you have a dex of 80 or better not yet damn it yana oh, yeah. work on I that do. shit i do dex i do what i thought you did yeah 85 yes I, did, I, did you increase your damage from that already, or no? What, what's the base damage of your gun? D12. Okay, so you need to go up one more from D12, which is the tricky D8 bit. plus D6, D6, I think. Yep, yeah. I think you're right. So, Yana, okay. instead of a D12, roll D8 and D6 and get better. Okay. Do it, Yana. Roll higher. The same. Okay, it shows him getting hit exactly in the same place. Going, ah, he's going to return fire. But Matt, what are you doing? So you're saying it's better for me to leap off to the guy at the side because then I won't if, be in the way of everyone's fire. Well, no, you won't be in the way of the carriage. Which if now, if you want to leap forward, that guy will be easier to leap onto because you've got momentum going. But then now make Pete make a carriage driving roll to not crash into you. It'll make things a little bit easier on you, a little bit harder on him because he has to make a roll. Eh, no, I don't mind doing for the side to make it a bit harder for me. I don't mind. Give me a jump at negative 30 and good luck. Yes. Right. <laughs> okay. Now. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, you, you land on the guy and give me a... Uh, grapple, sword, something, because I'm curious to see how things are ending up on Matt's end with this guy who's looking really surprised that you jumped I off. I got my sword. <laughs> All right, of course you did. Yeah, I'm seeing shish kebab. Figure out damage. Uh, Pete, now, Matt's not with this guy, but it's up to you if you want to swerve around him or just plow into him. He's Do playing like chicken. Do I get more damage from the inertia? <laughs> I know. If you'd gone forward, you'd have gotten more damage. Yeah. You went to the side, so you've That's got right. some, but not. That's all right. Some. Yeah, I think, I think you're. Nine points. Yeah, okay. He looks super, super in pain. All three of you to go to the ground. The horse dramatically falls over and is kicking his legs. Uh, right. Now, uh, we're going to go willpower versus willpower, Pete, for the chicken game. Mm -hmm. This guy has – whoever loses has to make their uh, roll. The other guy just goes straight or whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, this guy's willpower is 12. What's yours? 17. Okay, so that's five. <laughs> roll a 75 or less. Otherwise, you break and yield, possibly wrecking your carriage, which would be ironic. 
Mm-hmm. Yes, I do. I make it. Make it. All right. Welcome. No problem. He now is stuck making his horseback riding roll in order to get out of your way. He simply attempts to move forward on the horse, missing by three points, causing your your carriage to clip his horse and inflict some damage. So, uh, Pete, go ahead and uh, roll a d6 damage, and then roll high low, whether it's on the guy or the horse. If you roll low, it's on the horse, and high, it's on the guy. Full and low. Got it. The horse takes four points of damage. Please keep track of the poor creature. It screams in pain as it gets grazed by the fuck. It just kind of like a cheese grater going down the side of the horse. The horse is not happy. Next round, this will make the guy make a roll. Uh, the other guys um, shoot into the air in order to attempt to intimidate you guys. Since PCs don't fall into that kind of thing, you guys can be laugh at them. Want. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Well, or maybe not. Heroes are first. Villains can't use ranged weapons, but screaming in terror is approved. Nice. Yeah, then. It's you first. I shoot. Same guy? Yeah. Okay, you're now kind of poked out and shooting back because you guys continue uh, I miss. No problem. It's because he wasn't slowing down for your shooting, the bastard. Mm. So, Matt, you're on the ground right now. So is the guy. So is the horse. All of you are on the ground. Okay, I take my turn to get up. Okay. Uh, shows the guy and his horse both do the same. Pete, what are you doing? Keep going. Ah, looks like your ride is leaving, Matt. Next That's round. Was part of the plan. Well, depends. What's Lacey doing? I should say. If Lacey has stopped, no. then I'm going to. She is riding I'm, then I'm gonna, like the wind. Good. Then I'm going to keep going. If she had stopped, I would have pulled up with the wag in between oh, yeah. her and the bad guys. Yeah. But, yeah. She, she's not fucking slowing down, dude. Uh, heroes yep. are first. Yeah. Maneuver, including ri riding uh, or driving a cab and stuff, is approved. So, Wasn't sure. Yana, yeah. uh, you've got a different target at about max range. Totally different guy if you're wanting a shot mm -hmm. at him. Uh, I try. Go for it. Yes. No problem. Nice. Do some damage to him mm -hmm. and keep track. It's a new dude. Matt, what are you doing there? The guy's like. Yeah, so I'm going to finish off the guy I've got. All right. Shit, yeah. Did you just do 11 to somebody? Yeah. Right. He goes, ah! Just mark him off. X. Nice. Right. My guy's up to 18. <laughs> right. It, it just shows this huge gout of blood and viscera and uh, <laughs> stuff like that. It just it shows it's spraying all over Alex as he drives his sword in. And uh, let's see, Pete, if you'd like to make, you don't have to make a drive carriage roll, but if you do and you succeed, you get a card. If you do and you fail, bad things happen because there are yeah, like no. ruts in either yeah. side of the road and shit. Yeah, no, no. That's fine. I'll keep going. I'm not going to. You not decide not to rock the cart. Got it. Exactly. No problem. Uh, the other guys are now chasing you and preparing to fire at you, Pete, because you are the driver and stuff, and they have much better view of you than they do of... So they're within 10 meters? So a couple of them are, yes. Not all of them. No. Yep. Next round. Oh, wait, no, they haven't gotten to go. Sorry. A couple of them are taking pot shots at you, Pete. Uh, let me roll, see how many. Uh, D6 minus two. Four of them blast away at Pete. <laughs> Actually, it's zap, 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 really loud. These guys are not quite experts, but they're better than hobbyists. Well, one guy's drawn from the old fumble deck. <laughs> one guy shoots Pete really well. And, okay, so uh, fumble deck, uh, hit and crit. So, well, yeah. Uh, let's see. The hit does... Only five points. Mm -hmm. The crit does an amazing five points. <laughs> and the fumble deck. Mm. Let's see. He got the draw five card. Right. <laughs> lose, okay, he's going to lose all of his actions. He's going to, and he's stunned. 
And so first lose all actions, then stun. His money all disappears. <laughs> uh, you guys are at a plus 30 to hit him. Which we already are anyway. Uh-huh. And he manages to shoot his buddy instead. I think that was five. Um, let's see. You managed to inflict the... Uh, you're not casting and damaging. Okay, yeah. And he shoots his buddy. So, oh, sorry. Let me just roll damage. Right. Uh, please mark one of the random dudes who hasn't been hurt. Whoever's keeping track of the damage has taken six. All right. And one guy's pretty much just going, kill me first. Oh, run to him. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It, just because it's a, it's a draw five, Alex is within a fucking simple action of him. Nice. He's on his horse, and he's going to be <laughs> galloping by, but assuming Alex is first, yeah. Uh, unfortunately, Alex is not. Oh, wait. Alex is not first. All right, we lost Yana. Ah. No. And I forgot I was in armor. That's all right. Because <laughs> I'm wearing our adventuring gear. Hmm. Got... Yana's almost back, but not quite. Her picture has really changed on her uh, hmm. on her real yeah. funny thing. She loves lying in grass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not as much as smoking. Oh, wait. No. Sorry. Anyway. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, I don't understand the lying in grass thing. I think it'd be better if you were to be able to grow grass uh, vertically and then stand in front of it, right? I think personally, that instead of the grass, you should just be in like a pool of blood. <laughs> it was hard to find a pool of blood, okay? <laughs> you know, Yana, for, for your character, I think that'd be better than you laying in grass because we're all very confused as to why you were laying in grass all the time. Blood is definitely more your thing. It's true. But there wasn't any, and I wanted to take a photo. I, I'm, thinking, I'm thinking just get on some old clothes sometime and get something red behind you that, you know, like have spray ketchup down or something, yeah. get a picture. It'll be awesome. Because imagine a new guy when you're logging in going. That would be nice. Lying in a pool of blood and smiling. <laughs> All right, so unfortunately for Alex, the bad guy is first. He oh. got five because he's still pretty much chasing. Maneuvers approved, so uh, give me a luck roll, Alex, for random people going by. Yana, you can take a shot at some random Quit. fuck soon. Oh, God damn it. All right. Uh, <laughs> I'll get back to you in a second. Hold on. Let me, let me do some more shooting and stuff. Um, let's see. I'm going to roll for random shooting. Same for Pete, D6 minus two. One guy. For Yana, it's minus two on the D4. One guy. Okay. So the one guy on P rolls a critical and shoots it. God, just shows his head open up and his brains fall out. Uh, Pete, you can do it. Uh, do you have a crap card I can tra trade you, Pete? I've got two opponent fails. So oh, okay. Right. I was an opponent fail, but you already yeah. won. <laughs> Which uh, I will play on this one. It's a mere 12 points of damage. I'm yeah, sure you so can play the that. opponent files on this one. All right. And the guy shooting Yana. Wow. Part of the cart gets ripped away as it's really close to Yana. It's now a hole in your fucking wagon or cart. Sorry. Yeah, I'm stopping down. the wagon and I'm going to go kill him. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still paying on this, you bastard. All right. So, uh, Heroes Turn Maneuvers approved. Oh, hold on. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yana. Uh, what do you do? There's random fuckers to shoot. I'm shooting. You shoot a random fucker. Well done. Go for it. They keep trying to execute Pete for some fucking reason. Mm -hmm. like I don't started. understand. Mm -hmm. Six. It shows you do the exact same shot to a different dude, and he's like, ah, and he does the exact same way, <laughs> like he's getting wounded. <laughs> And Matt, there's a, some guy galloping by on his horse. He's like, well, this guy's dismounted. And what's that, a sword? He's not a threat. And he's galloping within simple action of you. And you're like... Is it him or the horse you're going for? Uh, no, I wouldn't hurt the horse. Probably right. him. Right. You're going to cut back. the horse's legs out from under it? No, I wouldn't be that. I wouldn't do that. Well, it just shows we, the horse sliding on the ground with no we legs. Can, we can sell the horse afterwards. 
Well, I know I was thinking that. I think, oh, at least might make some money back yeah. the horses, the guns. Jump. jump. And jump, jump. There, eight. All right. <laughs> He's definitely wounded. He's running by bleeding or riding by bleeding. Going, ah. Uh, you, yeah. Uh, and Pete. Maybe yeah, no, keep going. Okay. He Keep now has the going. easiest job in the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. Next round. Villains are unfortunately first, but attack is approved. Uh, right. On Yana, we have one guy attempts to shoot Yana. <sighs> Blows another hole in your handsome cap. Oh, my God. It's slowly starting to come apart around you, Yana. On mm -hmm. Pete. Several people, meaning one, blast away at him recklessly, trying to dislodge him. He's going to do a fumble deck. Is that a fumble deck? Yay! Foe reroll. Whatever you have done is messed up, giving all the foes who are fighting against you a free reroll. Uh, if you're not fighting against any foes, you can just re look relieved and get on with your life, your miserable, fumbling life. So, <laughs> right. So, I. Uh, Hey, Yana, if you want to turn and shoot that guy, if you miss him, you get a free reroll. Or if you hit him and don't like your damage, you get a free reroll. I try that. Yes. All right. Great. Go for it. He's screwed. Nice. If she does Ooh, six again, nice. it's exactly nice. nice. <laughs> Oh, he did. Blasted he off did. of his horse. It appears that uh, like, I don't need your stinking reroll. <laughs> yeah, that's not. It. All right, and uh, going on to uh, Alex. Alex, there's a guy who's like giving you a wider berth because you just chopped down somebody else, and you're covered in blood with a big two-handed sword that has runes up and down it and seems to be glowing a bit. So he's giving you a big berth, meaning you need to get a sprint roll and then go first next round, and then you can fuck him up. Mm. But if you make a sprint roll and don't go first, then you're the only one back here with no wagon or horse. I made a sprint roll. All right. So you're hoping you're first. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're going to need to get a horse somehow, or you can take this guy's horse if you do something really clever, but you've only got one hand. He's already killed. Uh, he'd have to chase down those horses because they're freaked out after having the guy who was riding you explode into a bloody... Uh, I'm outrage. taking this guy's horse. Don't worry. I got a plan. Oh, good. All right. uh, Pete, all right. yeah, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yana, did you draw a card for a successful attack this Ooh. round? No. Please do. And we now go to next round, the old oh, Alex Kinley round. Heroes first. Heroes are first. Yes. Yes. Now, Pete, stunt riding or driving is approved no. if you'd like to no, try no. some crazy, stupid shit. Man, I should no. get a card for what I'm going to try to do. Uh, you might if if it's if it's a, a good enough stunt. But first, we'll start with Yana. Yana, um, there's a. Let me see how many people are getting ready to shoot you. One, and how many are getting ready to shoot Pete? None. There's one dude. You know he's within range because he's getting ready to shoot you. So go for it. You've got to get him. I. It's probably actually. Let me see if it's the same guy you wounded before. Low and it is. Now it's a whole new guy, Yana. They just keep changing up and falling back, and oh, pretty much every there. every one of them is wounded. Nice from from all the various bits and pieces going on. I think I have to do the morale soon. So Yana, how do you do? Seven damage. All right, she has the exact same wound. Ah, Jesus. So base and if it is one of the one random ones from previously have taken damage, that'll put them up to thirteen. Uh. I made a new guy. Is there any left that are not wounded? Did, we're mm -hmm. down to four guys. Not we're down That's to three it? guys in. Well, three guys and the one on Alex. Holy shit! Okay, yeah, she takes out be, one. Yeah, we may be we may be actually down to less, depending on how many. I didn't okay. quite catch everyone. Alex has taken out. I've only taken out one. All right. Yep. So yeah, I've I've got it correct. I wounded one. Yep. I've taken out one. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Alex, this is your big, big chance here. You need this no, horse. What are you going to do? I'm sprinted up behind the horse and I'm going boing, like onto the back behind the guy. Give and me I'm a jump roll. <laughs> Give me a jump roll and you'll be. Yes. 
And it shows Alex right the... behind him. The guy's like, no. He's oh. hoping he goes first next. Oh, wait, oh, no, he hasn't gotten to go yet. Do I get called for stunt maneuver? Yeah, sure. Is that good enough? <laughs> sure. That's that's crazy stupid. Yeah. All right. Now, oh, for his round. I... Hmm? Sorry, I also asked Joshua if he has a gun. Yes, I've got two guns. Because I I'll pass it over the guns. Right, he um, holds it out. You're going to have to use an action to take the gun, Yana. So he's holding it out this round. Okay. What's that, Matt? Uh, are you ready to change rounds yet? Is there, is everyone gone yet? Or are we still in this? Uh, no, no. I, I was getting ready to uh, uh, do the bad guys. They haven't gotten to go right, yet. Okay, yeah, yeah, do that. But before you do, I'm going to let you know straight away now that I'm playing a round revision on this round. So we definitely get to go first next round as well. It's up to you. This wasn't a wildly good round. No, but if we get to go together. first. Mm -hmm. True. Rather, and, and we might have some more crazy drivings and get cars. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So, uh, bad guy's turn. The bad guy is going to attempt to knock uh, McKay off the horse. He's pitting his 50 strength against whatever McKay's got to push him off of his horse. What do you got, McKay? Or, sorry, not McKay. Uh, Kinley, what do you got? Strength. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, strength is 90, 92. No, 91. It shows the it shows a push him and that horse literally gets torn in half because he's just <laughs> like it with his leg. Ninety one. So that's about a forty difference. So not to get knocked off the horse, I need you to roll a ninety or less there, Matt. Otherwise he valiantly pushes you off of the horse and laughs at you as you fall in the dirt. Oh, ninety or less. Nine Three. zero. There All right. Go. Yeah, he pushes you and you look at him like eh. <laughs> It just shows the horse kind of. It shows the horse's eyes bulge as you pinch your legs slightly <laughs> with eyes of steel. You've broken the last eight thigh masters you've had. <laughs> what are you trying to do? <laughs> are you trying to, um, you trying to come on to me? Uh, she killed that guy. The others. Uh, the others make their fucking yeah. The the remaining what is it? Two three guys that Alex yeah. is not on the horse of. They decide she somewhere got. else is better. So they're now riding off. Um, and one of them is commanding the others. He's like, come on, let's get out of here. And the guy's like, I can't believe they're all dead. Uh, so it appears that next round, you're going to have to wildly change direction if you want to clean up the last, the last of these bandit scum. Or nah, focus is lacy, so don't want to lose her. <laughs> I know what I'm doing with this guy. Oh, who knows? Alex may go after him. So, oh, yeah. sorry, you're keeping the same round. Mm -hmm. So, heroes are first. You play your round revision now. Yep. Heroes are first. Villains are second. Stunt driving slash riding is approved. So, uh, starting off with Yana. Yana, they ride out of your pathetic range on your pistol. You wish you had a rifle, but you spend your round taking the new pistol yeah. from McKay, yeah? Yes. Taken. What do you want to do with the old one? Oh, you got two pistols now. Fuck it. You got two hands. The good Lord gave you two hands. That means you can have multiple guns, is how they say. And the other I'm, gun would have been out of ammo, I'm assuming, yes. which is because it's the big nasty gun and only has yes. a few yeah. shots. No worries. Uh, skipping over to McKay real quick, I'm assuming go straight. Yep, yep, yep. Great. Target. Back to Alex. Staying on target. Staying on target. Mm, stay on target. Alex, what are you doing? It's stunt driving riding time. And my horse now. I just... The I just throw the guy off the horse. Uh, right. right, he's got he's got stirrups on side. I'm giving him plus ten for that roll and eighty or less to go mine. Eighty eight zero. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, twi the twenty five and the twelve both do it. Fine. <laughs> it just shows him rolling. Uh, roll d six damage on him when you push him off of the horse. <laughs> Three. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm in so much pain. Uh, to be fair, just be thankful you get to live. <laughs> if I wasn't in a hurry, I'd have her skin you. Right, next round. This is the last round of combat, unless you guys decide to go back after well, the other guys. It's, or... it's the enemy's turn, if you want them to do anything. Uh, he gets up and uh, simple actions away from you. <laughs> 
Well, that's it then. If yeah. there's no. Yeah, if you're continuing on, I'm just going to do the one last round because wit is approved. Yana, say something witty for a card. Uh... <laughs> All right. Over to Alex. <laughs> Eight against three, the odds were stacked unfairly against them. Hmm. Guard B. It was going to be a slaughter in our favor. <laughs> Excellent. So, yeah, guard and right. Uh, eventually, let's see. It comes down to this. <laughs> Pete, she is not fucking interested in stopping and shit. So you're going to have to catch her in your fucking carriage. And Alex is going to have to catch. So from Alex and Pete, Pete, I need to drive carriage roll. Alex, I need to ride a horse roll. And she's going to attempt her ride horse in order to escape you guys because she's not stopping. Yeah. Well, you guys might just catch up on I it. I my or, ride horse. Well, both of you have a plus 10 on yours because she did not do great. Um, Pete, yeah, you got Pete. a comfortable ride. And you're wishing this thing had a bar in it. Maybe you could have somebody yeah. install one. If only you knew a master oh. carpenter. Oh, yeah. You do. Uh, Pete, do you have a, um, a crap card? I've got a full retrieve and two opponent fails. God damn. Okay, well, I think you want this one, so uh, give me one of the opponent fails and I can give it back to you later if you need it. Yep, yep. That's fine. Uh, I can take it, coach. Yeah. Deal up all that damage you took. Yeah, lovely. There you go. That's a bad yeah. card play, boys. Mm hmm. Lovely. I used to get so excited by that card, and now it's Alex. I'm like, eh. <laughs> <laughs> Give it five yes. rounds. I'll be fine. <laughs> yes. No there problem. Uh, yeah, McKay's all still bloody and or shot up looking and stuff with holes in his clothes, but he's fine. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. So, uh, how did McKay do on his uh, drive yes. coach roll? Yes. Yep. And how did Matt do on his ride horse roll? I got it. Right. You guys uh, eventually chase this poor person down, and it turns out it is her. Yeah, you say. And she's like, huh? Don't worry, your father is dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. She hugs Yana and cries for a while. What an, what an introduction. <laughs> yeah, says, beautiful. But, but what about Elroy and the seven deadly sins? Uh, the guys that were chasing me. Oh, they were oh, dead. The dead guy. Most also, of them are dead. Oh, there's three of them still alive or something, but they're not looking happy. It shows all three of them in like just a face <laughs> shot. <going. laughs> One of them's crying a little bit. Well, right. that that was over on the seven deadly sins. Oh, that sucked. <laughs> uh, you gave him such a stupid name. I think Elroy did. Mm. Mm. 